Joining me now on this episode of Locally Sourced CP is the owner of Bottle Bean Bottle Boom over on Woodrow Bean in Northeast El, Northeast El Paso, Miss Monica Pacheco. Mr. Pacheco, thank you for joining us today. Thank you for having us. Uh, the, uh, this is exciting. I've, I've never had a business like yours on before. And, um, you know, I'll just come out and ask the first question. What is Bottle Bean Bottle Boom? Yeah, so Bottle Bean Bottle Boom is a liquor store located in Northeast El Paso. Uh, we just tried to be uh, different than any other liquor store, the vibe, the environment, the products that we carry. So we're trying to be like just different. <laughs> I, I'll ask you right off the bat, because I'm sure everyone's going to ask or notice. How did you come up with the name of your, of your <laughs> store? I went through about a million uh, names in my head. And uh, I mean, I just that one just stuck and I just I couldn't let go of it. It just seemed like uh, gold to me. So I kept it. <laughs> oh, it's cool. It's it's very catchy. And like, uh, if like you say, it's like almost a tongue twist if you say it too fast. So yeah. even when I was typing it out, like for to send you the email, I was like, hey, did I spell it right? And it's like, oh, yeah, that's it, it, it's just such an interesting name. And your logo is really cool, too. Thank you so much. Yeah, I appreciate it. We put a lot of love into it. So, uh, yeah, we definitely love the name and the logo. So thank you. <laughs> oh, how, how did you all get started? I mean, what, what made you want to want to go ahead and open a business like this? So um, I was in liquor sales out of town in uh, Fort Stockton, Pecos area, and uh, I wanted to come home and I just felt like I, I grew like a passion for wine and spirits pairing, or I'm sorry, spirits and wine pairing with food. So I was like, okay, let's do this. So um, I just went with it. <laughs> Although that's cool. That's cool. I'm, I'm, and you know, there's not many local businesses like this here um i i i I've, i apologize but i'm not your guys are the only ones i know i know like the big name ones here around town but that's so cool that you're able to open up locally here thank you yeah i appreciate it so we're trying to be a little different than the the, the corporate brands we're trying to be like a like a small town well not small town feel like a more like a small uh welcoming fun shopping experience i didn't want it to be like when you go in and you're overwhelmed and you're like oh yeah. my gosh where is this I, I wanted it to be small enough to where you can find what you wanted but big enough to have a selection yeah and like, i admit some some of the the bigger name ones you walk in and it's almost like i mean they got like bars on on their windows and it's kind of sometimes it's kind of dark and stuff like that yeah. but your place seems a little more lively a little more brighter yeah, I mean, we have four TVs going on with music videos at all times. I mean, we love jamming out. We want people to come in here and be like, wow, I'm actually having fun shopping. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's awesome. Customer experience, I think, is always number one, especially if they you come to a place like yours and like, even if they're just walking by, they're, yeah. they're, they go in there like, hey, this place is pretty cool. And they go and they come inside and you got like these videos going on, you got music, got TVs, a different shopping experience is always what draws customers in. Thank you. That, that's so I'm sorry. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's just um, it's just pretty cool. I'm really excited about this one. And I mean, just uh, what are some of the things you guys specialize in selling there? Bottle Bing, Bottle Boom. So our our thing is trying to carry things that you won't find at uh, other liquor stores. Like for for example, like sake. A lot of liquor stores don't carry sake or um, port wine. So we try to get things that people could just come here, get what they like, and then you know. Uh, things that a lot of the bigger stores don't offer because people don't buy them every day. Mm -hmm. So I try to do that. And then I, I definitely, definitely love supporting local brands. I have so many local brands in here. It's crazy, but I love every, I love it. And they're all bestsellers. So oh, that's cool. That's so cool that you, you're not only your local liquor store or mm -hmm. spirit shop, you also support local, the local, local, um, you, don't, you distribute it locally. Sorry. I couldn't think of the word to say. <laughs> Yes, yeah, so we have like a clothing brand that's local, Il Paso. Uh, we have local beer that we just brought in, Aurelia's. They're located on the west side. And we just spoke with Craft with Rhythm and Brews, and we're going to bring in some of those beers. So we're super stoked about that. Uh, we have two distilleries in El Paso. Uh, the first one is Sun City Distillery, and the, sec the second one is Prospect Spirits. And we have all of their spirits, and we're just excited to carry all of them. There's also uh, a Bloody Mary mix. Uh, <laughs> do you mind if I grab the bottle because it's a tongue twister for me? No, get it. Yeah, that'd be so okay, great. Yeah, ahead. no, no, go ahead. That 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 is, that is so cool. So it's, a, it's, it's a Bloody Mary so mix. It's made, here. it's made in El Paso, and it's freaking awesome. So. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, and then we have other things like these earrings are, are from the farmer's market. I don't know the lady's name, but she made them out of beer cans 
Oh, so. <laughs> those are so cool. So you guys, you guys show, you guys sell some other stuff there at the store, correct? Yeah, definitely. I mean, you know, your popular uh, liquor, uh, craft beer, wine. Uh, let's see what else we have. We have cigars. Ooh. I think we're the only one in the Northeast at the moment that carries cigars, but they're going to be trickling in uh, pretty fast. So. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. Yeah, I, I, I enjoy. I like to enjoy a good cigar every now and then. So I'll, I'll go by and pick some up for you guys for sure. Nice. <laughs> so, I mean, uh, is there anything, um, I mean, like you guys are located at 4650 Woodrow Bean, uh, over there, over here in the Northeast. I'm in the Northeast. I say over here. Cause I'm over here too. Uh, oh, lot, huh? I said, oh, sweet. Cause I'm yeah. from the Northeast. So I'm all about it. <laughs> Same here. I, I'm, I'm born and raised out here in Northeast. So I'm all about Northeast. I, I still consider us a redheaded stepchild to all the city. Cause they have, <laughs> everywhere else gets good, like better stuff. And we're slowly getting more and more good stuff. So I'm gonna say, not anymore. <laughs> yeah, I know. Right now that we got some places like yours, that's, that's pretty awesome. Thank you. <laughs> oh, I, I, um, is there, I, I'll ask, I'll ask the, the tough question right now. So uh, what is your favorite beverage there at your shop that you enjoy the most i think it'd be easier to answer which isn't my favorite <laughs> oh. <laughs> is, is there one like a go-to like uh, that you know especially for a party what, what what's like a go-to party mix drink or, or 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 any spirit or or beer that you would suggest if someone's some to trying something new okay. i love my i love bourbon and i like it neat so mm -hmm. right now my favorite go-to bourbon is a uh, brindle bourbon and that one's locally made Oh, nice, nice, nice. And then I'll, I'll have to ask uh, when you guys when uh, you guys there are 21 and over you guys card and stuff like that just to keep it safe, right? Oh, definitely. Uh, yes, definitely. It, we want to keep everyone safe. We definitely don't want to condone underage drinking whatsoever. I mean, you know, your time will come guys. So <laughs> yeah, you, wait, wait, wait your turn. We all had to wait yeah. our turn. So yeah, we definitely card everyone. There's no underage uh, whatsoever. <laughs> oh, that, that's so awesome to hear that you guys practice that. And I'm a big stickler for, for safety like that, especially, you know, like for, for places around town, just to keep everyone safe. So I appreciate that you guys do card and uh, don't sell to underage. So that's awesome of you guys. Right. So Drinking is definitely a big responsibility. So you just want to make sure that you're mature enough. And, you know, I mean, even as an adult, it's kind of hard but <laughs> to be mature when you're drinking. But you definitely want to make, we want to make sure that you have to be, you know, 21. It's very important. <laughs> no, I, and I appreciate you going over that because I mean, like, I, uh, like I said, that, that is a, a big, big thing to talk about, like safety wise and underage drinking and things like that. I just want everyone to be safe and have a good time. Yes, definitely. That's so awesome. <laughs> I, I, I'm a big, I, you know, I, I, I usually um, once in a while, you know, if I, if I have a drink, I do a little Jack and Coke. Is there something you would suggest for me to try? Jack and Coke. So the other day I tried a gentleman's jack with a splash of coke mm. <laughs> and I would recommend that one just to move it up a notch. <laughs> oh nice. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna have to come by and pick one up from you guys and try some of the local ones too. Cause I mean I, I'm a big supporter of local. So I and I and I'll be honest, I haven't tried anything local and I, I need to. And I think your show your store would probably be the best place to start. That'd be awesome. Yeah. So uh, and then you guys uh, uh on are you guys you guys have social media, things like that, right? we love social media we're all over it <laughs> so we have a uh, instagram facebook tiktok i haven't really jumped on the twitter thing yet but eventually it's coming i mean i locked down all the, the usernames when we first started so oh, we have them now we just don't utilize uh, uh twitter yet but definitely we're on tiktok instagram facebook oh that's so awesome and, and i'll make sure and you guys also have a website uh bottle bling b bottle so I, I can't i can't say it <laughs> Bottle being bottleboom.com is you guys' website. Yes. <laughs> yeah, you, you guys can find them on Twitter. Uh, I mean, not Twitter. They're good in Twitter. Find them on Facebook, Instagram on the, on their website. And I'll make sure I include all of the information in the description below. Um, Ms. Pacheco, is there anything else you'd like to say or add before we end today? Um, no, just that I, I just want to thank everyone thus far for supporting us and uh, becoming our regulars and our friends and now family. I mean, it's just, it's, it's turning into like a, to me, it's like a community store and I, and I love it. I love all of our customers. We just, it just makes me happy. I mean, I couldn't be here without each and every one of them. So I want to thank them all for making this dream come true for me and my family. Oh, that's so awesome. And thank you. And thank you for coming back home and starting this year. <laughs> thank you. Well, Mr. Checo, I'll let you go. That way you can get back to work and uh, I will make sure I get all the information description below again and um, be safe out there. Thank you. You too. Thank you.